Hey guys, so this is like the second time I'm doing this video because I tried to do it off the YouTube little upload thingy. <laughs> my mistake because the bitch freaking deleted my videos because I had a bad connection. So I learned my lesson and I'm now doing this in my photo booth. Okay, that was my little rant. I just wanted to get that out there because I'm a little agitated. But anyway, this week's topic is awkward questions and how to answer them. First, let me say that nobody owes any bitch any freaking... Um, answers about being trans um, if they can ask you a question they can pull out their phone or go on their laptop and look it up I mean when I was first coming out I thought oh let me educate bitches and make them smarter and like get them to see it my way and then I quickly realized that some people want to ask dumbass fucking questions that they know they shouldn't ask just to be a bitch because I was educating them yeah this one person asked me, he didn't know me at all. He was one of my friend's friends. The bitch asked me if I had a penis or a vagina with my friends in the room. That was one of the most awkward moments of my life, and I did not answer that question. I remember for the rest of the day, for the rest of the night, I felt like shit. Like, wow, that literally, I literally just had that experience. Mind you, this bitch has had Trans 101, and in Trans 101, they're, they're, mm, somebody always says, never ask a trans person if they have a penis or vagina. And that's just common sense. Like, that was a stupid question. There is a such thing as stupid questions, and that was a motherfucking stupid question. Like, why would you ask somebody that? I don't understand. I really don't. Like, that was just some dumb shit. But, um, yeah. How to handle it? Honestly, guys, like, I handled that situation by saying, I'm not going to answer the question. I should have handled it by saying, who the fuck are you? You don't even know me. Why the fuck are you answering this question? No, I shouldn't. That's, like, the bad way to handle it. Honestly, though, sometimes it's just better to say... I'm not, I don't feel comfortable answering that question. Even though in the back of our head we all want to say, shut the fuck up, bitch, you don't even know me, like, what the fuck do you think? Or, you could counter it, be a little sassy, and be like, I don't know, do you have a penis or a vagina? And then the bitch will say, I have a penis. And then you can say, well, there's your fucking answer, ho. No, don't do that either. Honestly... I learned that walking away from those stupid questions is way better than, like, trying to sit there and, and, like, just engage with that person. Like, first of all, that person is clearly ignorant, so why would you want to engage with them anyway? And second of all, they're not worth the fucking dirt on your shoes. So just, like, just let them go. Just, like, say in your head, you know what, fuck you, and then move on. Like, I said, I'm not going to answer that question. I kept on hanging out with my friends. Didn't give no fuck. Like, some people just want to be assholes. And then there are those people who want to learn. And some people might actually ask you this question, but based on his tone, he was being an asshole. But for people that, you know, there there are probably some people who are going to be like, so, if you don't mind me asking, do you have a penis or vagina? And you can say, like, oh, I don't feel comfortable answering that. Or you can tell them. But I mean, like, it, I don't know. That question always is just like, why would you, why would you want to know? Like, do you want to have sex with me? Like, are we about to sleep together then tonight? Do you need to know that? Do you need to know if you know we should get some condoms or something? Like, why would you want to? Why would anybody ask that question anyway? Pretty much. But um, yeah. Sorry guys, I had a little rant because I was really mad because YouTube was fucking me over. But um, yeah. Here's how I would I handle it. I just say I'd rather not answer. And I move on and I go on about my day because there's 24 hours in a day and one bitch is not going to ruin the rest of my 23 hours. Although my first hour will have been ruined. The rest of them will be chase. Um, So yeah, I'm going to end this and I hope everybody had a is having a really good week. And I love you guys and I'm on time. So yay. Um, I'll see you guys next Tuesday. So bye.